hello guys and welcome to a brand new video today i'm here with my a new trailer reaction uh this is jojo's bizarre adventure stone ocean official trailer and i'm going to react to this now first of all before we start um i have to say something here that i am still in the middle of watching jojo's you no know? i'm watching it in my spare time and i am currently at the middle of stardust crusaders so technically i am reacting to this without knowing what's going to happen after you know uh, like uh, from the middle of stardust crusaders i have no idea what's going to happen i'm currently watching it so in a way you know i should probably have like you know have not reacted to the trailer because there are spoilers but um because jojo is so popular i actually am spoiled about a few things in jojo what's going to happen for example the main thing that i know is uh, i think the main character here uh, her name is joylin and i know that she is the daughter of jotaro like these are the two main things that i know that obviously i got spoiled about because jojo is so popular and i see jojo like like for example like everywhere so yeah I, I, like naturally i got spoiled about that so i think like uh it won't really matter if i react to this trailer because you know like i'm already spoiled i know what is going on so that's why i decided to like you know kind of check this out even though i have still not watched jojo part 4 or 5 i'm currently in the middle of part 3 so yeah so let's get started let's get started with this reaction and i plan on completing jojo's by the time this like you know part six officially comes out as an anime so i plan on completing jojo by that time and then i plan on reacting to part six on my channel so yeah so anyways let's let's watch this trailer what this is about and um yeah and the original link to the video will be given down in the description box so without further ado let's get started all right so here we go first i'm going to react to it then i'm going to talk about the trailer Oh, that's Joylin, isn't it? Yeah. Oh, what? 2011. Joylin. Wait, she also gets imprisoned? It's just like her dad. But this is for 15 years. Okay. Hardened criminal. Whoa, whoa! Damn! Whoa! Wait, wait, so this is going to happen in a prison? Ow! There is! Jotaro. Okay, and he, he always, I always had that star mark, birthmark. Imperial. Jotaro Kujo. Whoa, whoa, whoa. あそこのアルバートから飛び降りたらさ、死ぬと思う。もう。この刑務所に送られる直前、私はあれを拾ったんだ。ジョリー、俺はここからお前を出すために来た。何なのよ、彼ら。ま、what <笑> Wow. Okay, wait, so oh wait, so is this going to happen in the prison? Oh that's very interesting because you know like I think like Jojo has always been the I don't know like something uh like for example Stardust Crusaders. It's like they like they completely like travel the whole world throughout the you know the whole uh uh, part three and I'm, I'm currently like in the middle of watching it you know i have completed the first part of uh, uh stardust crusade and the second part is left so like you know i'm quite familiar with it so yeah like 
you know in that like they like travel around the whole world and it's interesting to see that this will happen i think from as far as i could understand from the trailer in a prison okay in, in one place in a prison okay this has been quite interesting to see you know and they're like you know like so as far as i could get join gets um uh imprisoned and she says that she's innocent uh she's imprisoned for 15 years that's a long time like you know for jotaro's part he just got imprisoned for a small little time and like you know uh his grandfather came and <laughs> bailed him out so like it was something like that but here it's like 15 years so obviously like to get her out of this mess uh, as Jotaro said, as, 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 as far as I could see in the later portion where in this trailer Jotaro says that I've come here to bust you, not bust you out, but get you out of here. Um, and so I'm guessing they are trying to prove, like Jotaro showed some uh, a picture of a guy. He said something like this guy is the main uh, culprit here who have been falsely accused. So I'm guessing they are actually trying to find some clues to... Uh, you know like present in front of uh i don't know everyone and say that yeah these are the clues and this guy is the main uh criminal i'm innocent something like that i'm guessing they're trying to do here and uh, interesting and one thing another thing i kind of noticed here this is something like uh his father divorced uh her mom that means Okay, I did not know that. I know that I knew that Jotaro was like uh, Joelin's father, but I did not know that uh, he and his wife get divorced. I don't even know who his wife is. I'm sh I think probably we'll get to know in the like, you know as I'm watching currently watching the third part. I'm guessing we're going to get to know uh, later on uh, who his wife is, Jotaro's wife is. So yeah, that one thing I'm not spoiled about. I don't know who his wife is. <laughs> I'll wait for it. I'll wait for the anime to actually tell me. And uh, yeah, okay. So another thing that we saw in this trailer is stand. Uh, Joelin stand. So Joelin stands looks like some kind of uh, threaded human, uh, you know, threaded humanoid thing. And uh, just like Star Platinum, it's uh, also something that. Uh, I don't know like I'm not sure what its power is maybe something like uh, Star Platinum can do precise things very well and here I can see that Joelin's uh, stand is like a threaded thing so I'm guessing is because of his dad or something you know like Star Platinum was something that can do something very critically and Joelin's stand is like a thread which is also something very uh, I don't know very uh, you know like very good I don't know what to say but very like you know like very fragile critical or something like that can do something very like you know um, yeah critically I, I don't know like I don't know what I'm saying but it kind of reminds me of Jotaro's stand in a way and uh, yeah so Jotaro here is going to let her know about her stand and teach her about it I don't know I don't know how he's going to do that but I can see that no, most probably Joylin herself will learn about it eventually, just like Jotaro did. But the problem here is that he's she's in a prison. So yeah, and I can see another thing that there are a lot of other prisoners as well who I'm guessing is like uh has their own stand. For example, th there's one person I saw with the green hair, that green haired girl. Her eyeliner was kind of evaporate evaporating up. I think that was a part of her stand or something. And there was this another I don't know white thing yeah white thing which was kind of melting i think i guess that was also a stand and uh, yeah now now i don't know if i missed something here because uh, as i said like you know and I, I know like most of it's kind of weird for me as well because i know most of the uh, people who have actually reacted to this trailer have already watched <laughs> jojo up until part five but i am quite exception to that because i'm currently at the middle of part three so i might have not able to get some kind of like, you know maybe there was something that was shown in this trailer that has some kind of connection with part four or part five i'm not sure i was probably not able to catch that 
because I have not watched those parts. So it's kind of like you know weird in a way for me to actually you know watch this. But I do plan on completing, as I said, JoJo's up to part five until this uh, you know by the time this anime comes out. And I'm sure I'll be able to do it. And I, I thought about reacting to part four and part five on my channel as well, but I kind of scratched that out because it's going to take a lot of time if I actually try to react to them. So like, you know, look, so I kind of thought that, no, I probably shouldn't do that because I really want to watch and react to part six when it comes out. So that's why I'm trying to complete this, you know, complete part four and five and the half of part three that is left by the time this comes out and if I like react to it, it'll take a lot of time. So I'm trying to quickly go through this and complete it so that I'm able to watch part six when it comes out. So yeah, and obviously like I'm guess, I think it's like the same, yeah, David production. The studio is the same and like I really like this type of an art style where it's you know like you can see like jojo's art style is quite unique and i really like it it i don't know it kind of gives a very unique feeling and the cattle looks really cool in in, in that way you know and uh, yeah and also i think this is the first time we're getting a female protagonist aren't we i'm not sure what uh, happens in parts after this like this part six i think there are a lot more parts after this as well as light novel i think in light novel format or manga format i'm not sure but you know like i think jolin is the first yeah she obviously she is the first first female protagonist and i'm really quite looking forward to that as well because you know we've always been accustomed to like especially anime watchers uh, accustomed to uh, in jojos especially uh, male main characters so it'll be really good to see a female main character here and yeah and uh, as far as I could tell uh, I really like her voice actor I'm not sure who he is just a sec let me just check out who is her voice actress or actor I'm not sure just a sec okay Kujo Joy Lean um, Pyros I Oh, wait, who is this? Why Rose? I. Oh, she's quite new, isn't she? Yeah, yeah, yeah. She, she started voice acting, I think, in 2018. Yeah, she's very new. Uh, okay, I don't know. Uh, like, I, I think like the two most famous, you know, like, uh, not most famous, but two animes that I am familiar with that she voice acted in. Uh, Fyro's eye are uh, how heavy are the dumbbells? Yeah, and cautious hero. These two animals are where she was acted in how heavy are the dumbbells as Hibiki Sakura and in cautious hero as Valkyrie. Oh, and all the other animals that she was acted in, I am not accustomed. Like I, I don't know about them. Oh, another anime I know is Full Dive. I've also watched that. So, yeah, these, so she's quite new and she's going to voice act as Joylene Kujo. And I really liked uh, the voice acting and I think it kind of uh, fits her in a way uh, because, you know, she seems like that type of a character, like, you know, uh, what do you call it? You know, very. I don't know like her face kind of matches with her voice that's what i'm trying to say and uh, yeah i'm looking forward to this so yeah that was it that was my reaction and obviously the signature ora ora at the end that was like the cherry on top so yeah great trailer and it it didn't i don't think it spoiled us much things like you know like we can see that she's in a prison and she's probably going to face a rough time here as you can see like you know they're kind of Saying stuff like oh you need to keep some money always when you're in a prison and we can see that like there's some kind of a bullying happening where you know like there's these this inmate who kind of slaps another girl probably uh, kind of bullying her or something and it'll be something like that you know where 
they'll be stuck in this not they but she'll be stuck in this prison and she'll have to go through these hardships and you know J jotaro will come in and he'll probably like you know he'll try to get him out, get her out of this and he'll also uh, tell her about her stand she'll realize that she has this kind of a power a stand power with her and she's going to use that to i don't know probably get some clues on who is the person who actually framed her in this uh, crime that she did not commit and at the same time she'll try to get out of this place and her stand looks really cool like you know it's like a blue humanoid with threads i think yeah and and it's wearing a sunglass <laughs> a green sunglass and i wonder what her um stand's name is you know like jotaro's stand's name is star platinum so i wonder what her stand's name is i'm sure we'll get to know but yeah she looks cool like you know like she, she's like standing with you know the, the the jojo like aura that kind of we are familiar with and her like, you know stand is also standing stand is also standing what the hell <laughs> but anyways <laughs> all right um yeah like i'm looking forward to this so yeah i'm sure i'll be up to date with jojo by the time this comes out i'll watch up until part 5 and i'll be patiently waiting for this to come out and i do plan on making a reaction of this on my channel when it releases so yeah so yeah guys that was it that was my reaction to jojo's bizarre adventure stone ocean official trailer i think i'm like the probably the first reactor who has reacted to this trailer <laughs> without even completing jojo <laughs> i'm currently in the middle of it so yeah anyway so thank you guys for watching if you guys enjoyed my reaction be sure to press the like button and subscribe if you're new to the channel or you haven't subscribed comment down below anything you want to say anything you want to let me know i'll check them out and i do plan on reacting to some other new anime trailers as well uh probably next week i'll be here with another uh reaction to a trailer and if you have any trailer you want me to react to uh, any upcoming anime trailer comment down in the description uh, comment down in the comment section and yeah i'll check it out so yeah so yeah guys that was it thank you guys for watching i'll see you guys in the next video so until then goodbye and have a nice day